You haven't killed all the beetles yet. You can't expect to train as a hero if you can't deal with a few insects. Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. Come and see me when you're ready. You look tired after killing those beetles. pie for the guildmaster at the end of the week. But I can't find any more red apples. I only need another four. If you find enough, can you bring them back here? I'll reward you. Thanks. Thank you so much. The guildmaster will get his pie. Here, have this. We're discussing whether I'm the fastest apprentice in this guild. I ran to the demon door and back in 50 seconds. Beat that! Right then, get to the demon door and back and talk to me in 50 seconds. Yeah, well, if it wasn't for my injured leg, I'd beat that time. You look tired after killing those beetles. Thank you. 
Your part. Oh. journey's length is of no consequence. The Oracle must be protected. How can you be so sure? We might need you here. Who knows what battles we might face? The signs are too strong to ignore, and the Northern Wastes have been too long isolated from the Guild. There is much I may learn there. Well, I hope nobody thinks you're running away from a fight, trying to cheat death again. You know how people talk. Talk is of no matter to me. May death close his eyes to you, Maze. What are you waiting for? Come in. That was Scythe. He was a great hero once, back when he had flesh on his bones and blood in his veins. He's just a shell now. What does he know of the choices we have to make? of what it takes to get things done. Showed you, didn't it? <laughs> You look tired after... Your training is about to begin. But you have many hard years of tasks and preparations beforehand. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind. But soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises. The nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Mays had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Get out of bed, lazy bones. We were supposed to meet the guildmaster on the other side of the river, but that was an hour ago. We better get going. Race you there.
late again. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin training with real weapons now. Get used to the weight of this sword, and let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. Come on then. Let's see what you've got, farm boy. <laughs> Come on, Dad, hit me! Hit her! What you waiting for? Lucky shot! Is that the best? Now pay attention. What I'm about to teach you could well save your life one day. The life of a hero is a dangerous one, and you must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block her attacks with your sword. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to handle anything Whisper can throw at you. I'll hit you next time. Let her attacks through. Oh. Well done. Now let's see if you can combine attack and defense. Ah, oh, hello, Thunder. Come to check on your sister's progress, have you? You could say that. Whisper told me you've got her training with some farm boy. Maze thinks the boy has great potential. Enough to keep up with my Whisper. Ha! <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. All right, children. Let's see who has learnt the most in their training. This will be a no-holds-barred duel. Just like your final melee test. Prepare yourselves. Wrong whisper. You need to practice more. Shame you couldn't see me fight in the arena. You might have learned a thing or two. Keep training if you want to go there yourself one day. I could have beaten him if you hadn't stopped us. We have few enough heroes as it is, without the two of you tearing each other apart in training. Speaking of which, meet me as I make my way to the archery range, when you're ready to continue your lessons. Oh, and about your melee performance. Excellent. Fight like that in your melee exam and you'll do well. Then meet me by the archery range to continue your training. Are you ready for your archery training? Let's continue our training with the bow. To begin with, see if you can hit the three stationary targets. And put some effort into it. The longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage you will cause. But make sure you stay within the circle. Targets. Unfortunately, most foes don't stand still. So let's see how you fare against moving targets. You have a minute to score as many points as you can. The front target is worth one point. And the one at the back will score you nine points. And remember, the longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage the shot will cause. More damage means more points, but you have to balance power firing rate and accuracy. 
Let's see what you can do. Come on, lad. Get your bow out. Behind your shops, lad. That's a good one. Plenty of power. Lovely. Oh dear. Try pulling the string back further for more power. Excellent shooting, my lad. Do that in your skill test and I'll be most impressed. Next, we will learn about the ways of the will. Speak to me when you're ready to continue with your training. I'll be heading to the island by the waterfalls. It's time to learn about will powers. We'll begin by striking these strong dummies with lightning. All right, let's see what you've got. Whoa. That's it. See how many you can hit in half a minute. Only attack dummies that are facing the center of the island. You won't get any points for hitting one on the back. You'll only waste valuable mana. Using your willpowers depletes your mana, and once used, it takes time to replenish. Excellent use of magic. Well done. Very good, lad. You have learnt the three hero disciplines. We can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time exploring the guild. I believe Whisper is about to go into the guild woods if you wish to join her. Very well. I'll be in the map room when you're ready to continue. Any apprentices want to prep? Right. This melee combat against Whisper counts. Right, let's get Whisper and you in the ring. Same rules as before. I have a special prize for you, if you manage an A+. How did that get through? Oh, lucky shot. All right, you can stop now. That was very impressive. Whisper should be ashamed. A plus. That grade means I can award you a new weapon. You really showed Whisper.
Right, this melee combat... Okay, come back whenever you need training. Archery grading! Any now the guildmasters asked me to grade everyone's archery skills. And if you get an A+, you'll receive a special prize. You've got one minute, starting when you fire your first shot. Use a bit more power. That was accurate, but not powerful enough. Set a new high score. Wow, I ain't never seen any better than that. You've got an A plus. The guildmaster said if anyone shot brilliant, I could award them this. Whew, that was some fancy shooting. You really showed whisper. Any apprentices need will training? You've got 30 seconds once you first cast lightning to hit as many targets as you can. There's a special prize for A-plus students, you know. Bloody hell, A+. Plus. The Guildmaster said to award these items to anyone who excelled at the will test. I still haven't seen anyone perform better than you. Can someone help me get rid of them? I need someone to kill the sparrows nesting around the guild. A disgusting vermin. Those damn sparrows are making a right mess of the guild. Just look at them. I'll pay you five gold for every one you kill. Just come and see me every time you kill another one. Killed any of the blighters yet? <sighs> Please stop. <sighs> Those impressions are not tolerated within the guild. Stop right now.
killed any of the blighters yet? Ah, you've got another. There are still more up there. Ha! Have you killed any more of them? Ah, you've got another. There are still more up there. Have you killed any more? Ah, you've got another. There are still more out there. I don't know how he did it! I always win guild competitions! Face the truth, you are that quick. Have you killed any? Ah, you got another. There are still more out there. But if I'm not the fastest, I must be the best at something. Well, you've got the biggest head in the guild, that's true. Have you killed any more? Ah, you've got another. There is still more out there. Have you killed any more? Ah, you got enough. There are still more out there. That was some fancy shooting. You really showed Whisper. I still haven't seen anyone perform better than you. You've come to the right place.
Oi! Stop being so annoying, you runt! Yes, you have. Have you killed any more of them? Have you killed any more of them? No, I haven't! Yes, you have! The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. For years the guild was his home, his school and his life. But as time passed, his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the Guild Seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Enter the Guild Woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. The test will be revealed to you there. Good luck. That was some fancy shooting. I suppose you're wondering how you pass the final test then. It's simple. You must defeat me, using all you've learned in your years of training. We'll begin with your sword. Hit me, if you can. Go on, fight me! Attack me! Very good. Now, shoot me with your bow. Uh, don't get too close. Ha! 
Well done. Ha! Well done. Excellent! And finally, cast lightning at me! Ah, a good strike! Ah. That's enough. Yes, quite impressive for a novice. You will find real battles rather more fatal than this. But you have passed your final test, and you're ready to receive your guild seal from the Guildmaster. Well, this is the day, lad. I remember the first night you came to us. And look at you now. Maze's faith in you was well placed. Now come along. The graduation ceremony will take place in the Chamber of Fate, the oldest part of the guild. Let the apprentices approach. For many years now, you have worked hard to earn yourselves the title of hero. Today, that apprenticeship ends and you go out into the world to do great deeds. Deeds that will bring you the gratitude of thousands. Or strike fear into their hearts. These are dark times. The shadows of Albion are stirring and strange winds are blowing. Your choices whether they lead you down the path of good or evil will change the face of the world. Now, take your guild seals and venture forth as heroes. It's time for you to leave us then. But you're still very much part of the guild. On the map table, you will find details of any quests the people of Albion wish heroes to perform. And you'll need to return often to focus all your experience into new skills. Only by doing this regularly will you advance as a hero. Step into the light and I'll show you how to do this. There is little else for me to teach you, but I will always be around to offer you guidance. And your guild seal will allow me to communicate with you at all times. You will also notice it flashing when you have enough experience to spend. I have given you a basic pack of supplies. It'll be enough for a while. Now there's a whole world for you to explore.
Check the guild for more quests. Chicken chaser to me, but then again, I ain't met one before. Remember, following the gold markers on your map will lead you to your quest objective. Wasps are attacking the picnic area! Follow me! Hurry! Way. Please, you've got to save my friend! You've received a new quest card. Chicken chaser. Right. Known as Maze is looking for you. He waits for you in the Barstone Tavern. Little snot bag. You know nothing of the world. Look at this filthy pile of rags. 
he really expects people to give him gold. Well, if you want, I'll tell you something that'll really annoy him. Used to be an adventurer like yourself, but look at me now, begging to survive and getting bullied by this brat all the time. You must be able to get rid of him somehow. Anything will do. Use your imagination. If you can get him to leave. Well, I'll be here if you change your mind. as bad as that stinking beggar. I'm out of here. Ha ha ha! Funniest thing I've seen in years. You've earned my thanks, hero. I'm sure you'll make many friends in your travels. Perhaps we'll meet again, hero.